All right, I'd like to demo for you the ladies flashbang holster. Just show you a little bit about how it works and how it's worn. Um, it's designed just to be worn horizontally underneath the bra band. It actually just tucks into place right here so that the grip is in the center of your body. And the cylinder of the gun actually is up inside the bra cup. The little strap right here is made to fasten around that center piece of the bra. And then you draw by just pulling straight down. Um, you can either lift your shirt to draw or you can draw by, if you have a loose enough shirt on, just gather up a bit of shirt and pull straight down and you can shoot through your shirt if you needed to. Um, there are a few features that I'd like to point out about the flashbang. Uh, one of them is the stippling right here on the holster. It just helps keep the barrel from slipping as you're wearing it. Um, some other ones are the different strap lengths. It actually comes with three different straps. Um, they're made to accommodate different size bra straps and you have an adjustment on each one. These are made out of a really soft suede so you can even customize it further than that by punching your own hole and just cutting the strap to whatever length you'd like. Um, another great thing about this medium length strap is that you can actually put this on the holster this way and it can be worn as an inside the waistband holster with this as your belt strap. Um, it functions great in that respect as well so it can be worn by men and ladies or by ladies as a cross straw holster. Then when you draw you're just pulling this way. It's pretty comfortable and it looks really well. When you are explaining to a lady how to wear this holster um, a couple of things you need to tell her are that she needs to make sure she gets this up inside the cup to the appropriate amount. If it's down where it's partly out, it'll start slipping and be uncomfortable. Um, it can help a lot if you lean forward whenever you put it on so that you actually are able to tuck it up high and then the uh, breast tissue fall down on top of the holster and hold it in place. Another thing that you can do to customize the fit is to flip this strap around this way if it's more comfortable for it to sit higher. Um, on some women, and me right now since I'm pregnant, the butt of the gun wants to kick out a little further than it normally would. So the higher you have it, the more that butt will tuck in and make it a little less obvious if you have on a really fitted shirt or something like that. As you can see, this is a very fitted shirt. Um, I am wearing a J-frame, um, just a dummy gun at the moment. But whenever it's worn properly, you can't see it at all, even under a really fitted shirt. This one I flipped the loop over to pull it up a little higher to help with the sticking out belly. But uh, this is how it's worn. This is what it looks like when it's proper. And whenever you go to draw it, just reach up and you've got your gun.